Hey guys, I'm back with another GoPro Tips and Tricks video. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how you can slow down the video in Adobe Premiere Elements. To do this, we come down into our timeline, find the clip we want to slow down. In my case, I'm going to slow down the... Uh, I'm going to slow down this clip here. As you can see right now, it's pretty quick and I can't play it much longer because after that it gets really shaky. So I'm thinking if I slow it down, maybe it'll be a little bit more usable. So what I'm going to do, I click on it once, then I right click, and uh, I open up Time Stretch, and I simply type in how long I want it to be. So I'm going to say I want it to be 50% of regular speed. No, not 250. 50% 50 of regular speed. Or, if I want it to be a certain time because of something else to do with my editing, I could come down here and say I want it to be uh, exactly 3 seconds. And then it would figure out what the speed it needed to be. I'll have another option here that I like to normally uh, click is maintain audio pitch. So what happens is when you stretch audio files out or make play audio slower, the tone of the audio clip, or the yeah, the tone goes becomes lower. If you speed them up, it becomes higher. So if you're going to do anything with voice or really anything that you want to sound natural when you've slowed it down or sped it up, maintain click this to maintain the audio pitch, and the software will figure out how much it has to um, change the pitch to make it sound more normal. So I always like to tick that one. Then I hit OK, and you'll see down here it'll have bumped the uh, the clip a little bit longer so that uh, it's now playing back for exactly three seconds. You play through it, you can, you can see it's now in slow motion. Maybe this isn't the greatest clip to uh, slow down, I don't know if I like it, but at least I showed you guys how you can slow a clip down in Adobe Premiere Elements. This works great for um, all kinds of things. Another option here that I want to show you guys before we, before we go is um, slowing down part of a clip. So I'll, I've got this clip here. I'm just going to scrub through it and I want to slow down the bit right as the kayak drops in the water. So I want it to be normal speed up until here. And then I'm going to hit this little pair of scissors beside my cursor, beside my uh, point there. So that cuts. Oh, oh, come on. That clips the auto the video clip into two pieces, and then I'll select where I want it to go back to normal speed, which will be just about here. And I'll cut that, and then I'll select this middle video clip here, the one I wanted to slow down, and I'll do exactly what I did before. I'll make it 50%. Click that and that, and now it'll slow it down. So now if we play through it. We haven't actually made the entire clip slow, we've just made that little part of it. Um, so this is great if you're making ski videos and someone's going over a jump and you want to slow down just them jumping but have them normal speed up until the jump. Uh, lots of people use it for that. There's there's lots of places where this can be really cool. Um, I like slowing down part of the clip. It shows that you have um, ability to edit and it's kind of a cool thing that people don't really know how to do. So really a great thing there, slowing down only a little part of the clip. Again, do that by slicing out the part you want to slow down and then slowing down that part. Um, one other thing just to note, this is now in three separate video clips, so if you're going to move this clip to another part of your video, um, you have to select all three of them, not just, uh, not you can't just click and drag on one of them because then you'll split it up, so make sure you select all three of them and move them as a package. Thank you guys for watching, this is another GoPro tips and tricks video. If you've enjoyed it, make sure you subscribe and like the video. If you have any questions or comments, make sure you leave them below. And until next time, thank you for watching.